The nation's defense chief visited the site where a North Korean soldier crossed over to the south while being shot at by troops from his side. The minister praised the allies serving on the border area for their swift response. Here's Kim Hyun Bin with the details. South Korean Defense Minister Song Yong Moo on Monday visited Panmunjom, where the dramatic defection by a North Korean soldier occurred earlier this month. Song toured the Joint Security Area Guard Unit's second observation post, right beside a military demarcation line separating the two Koreas. He was briefed on the defector's route across the MDL by the Secretary of the United Nations Command Military Armistice Commission, U.S. Army Colonel Steve Lee. Song praised South Korean and U.S. troops for their swift response to the rare defection of a North Korean soldier via Panmunjom. South Korea and the U.S.'s swift response and decision-making during the dangerous situation was well handled. The defector attempted to use a jeep to escape across the MDL until the vehicle became stuck in a drainage ditch. As the defector got out of the jeep and started sprinting towards the military demarcation line separating the two Koreas, four North Korean soldiers opened fire at him. Dozens of rounds were fired with several bullets hitting the defector. The soldier is currently recovering at a hospital near Seoul. The JSA has served as the venue for negotiations between the two Koreas under the jurisdiction of the United Nations Command since the armistice agreement was established in 1953. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.